Hi everybody, this is David Herrera from the Tips Team here with another video about Chrome OS. This time we are talking about keyboard settings. Now, on Chrome OS, you can change your keyboard settings if you would like to access a different language uh, for your keyboard to be able to write down certain symbols. Um, and it's pretty easy. So we're gonna head over to the quick settings and head to settings right there. If you have settings already saved onto your dock, you can just click on it right there. But on the search bar, I'm going to type in keyboard and that's gonna take me to the keyboard section of the settings. I'm gonna scroll down to input settings and in here, I can select the different languages that I want for my keyboard. So for example, um, by default, you're going to have just English, US English, but I can add different input methods by clicking on here. Let's say I teach Spanish, so I'm gonna type in Spanish for Latin America. And once I add it, I actually get a new button on my shelf down here that lets me change between keyboards. Um, right here, I can just click on Spanish Latin America or English US, and I can add as many input methods as I want. Um, let's say I also teach French, so I'm gonna go ahead and add Canada French, and you'll see on here that a new language is added. Finally, there's some keyboard shortcuts that show up for me. If I wanna switch in between input methods, I can go Control Shift Space, and you'll see on the bottom, right by the dock, uh, sorry, by the quick settings here, that it's switching between different keyboards. If I just go Control Space, it's gonna switch between the two settings that have been used last. If you wanna get rid of any of your languages, just click X on my input settings, and that is pretty much it for keyboards. Now, don't forget to head over to our YouTube channel to subscribe. We post videos weekly about Chrome OS, uh, Google Workspace, artificial intelligence, all types of educational technology topics. As well, don't forget to connect with your TIPS member if you're interested in getting any professional development for your school, or if you just wanna connect with regards to educational technology. That is it for me today. Have an awesome day.